Hello guys, it is a bittersweet day today. Um, I'm very sure you've all seen the news and here in the US a lot of universities have decided to take preemptive measures by doing online classes and in some cases sending students home. So in my case here at, wow that was like painful, <laughs> in my case here at USC, um, First, they just said we were going to do online classes for a week, and then they decided to extend them all the way until April 14th. Um, and essentially, this coincides with our spring break, and basically, they said, don't come back from spring break. Um, they're letting people stay in student housing if they inform the university that they are, but most people are going on spring break and not coming back. I had booked a one-way ticket home, assuming this would happen. So, yeah, it's kind of been insane. A lot of my friends from abroad are coming back home and a lot of my friends who had planned spring break trips abroad are just staying here or going home. Um, so it's going to be an interesting trip of taking online classes at home. So I guess this is just my vlog of me saying goodbye to USC for a little while, um, which is sad but understandable. Hey guys, so I thought I would start off with a little clip of I guess the last time that I was at USC and me just kind of packing up and leaving to come here. I have been home for almost two weeks now and then I will be headed back to LA in May, hopefully assuming my internship is still happening, which it looks like it is. Basically, I thought I would show you guys a bit of a day in my life as now an online college student. To start, I guess I just need to say that I have been waking up around 1 or 2 p.m. every day, which is actually fine with my classes because now that I'm back on the East Coast, my earliest class starts at 1 p.m. East Coast time. So that has been totally fine. All right, so basically this is a typical week now in my life. I have had to delete all of research and job and everything else that I was doing. So my goal this semester was to be taking less units. So I'm only in four classes and then I am auditing a film class here. This one's really cool. It's like one of the most famous classes at USC and you basically just go and watch movies before they come out and then they bring someone from that movie, like a producer or an actor or a screenwriter, to come and talk to you about it. So anyway, it's a really cool class, but I'm just auditing it so I could like see the movies without doing any of the work. And as you can see, it ends at 1 a.m. on Eastern Time, so I will not be attending that most likely. Now that I don't have work or research, I basically have my Tuesdays and Thursdays completely free, so I've been like filling it with like other appointments that I have to be doing. Basically on my typical Wednesday, I figured I would show you guys today just because like I am typically in more class than in other days. Um, I usually have an 8.30 a.m. lecture, but that's not every week, so it wasn't this week. And then I go into my chemical reactors class, which the teacher had, like, low-key ghosted us. Anyway, yeah, so she finally sent us a message and told us that she will be filming the lectures and then sending them to us, and then later we'll do them on Zoom. I think is my understanding of this. And then my next class is my heat and mass transfer, which he's been doing on Zoom um, when that comes. So I guess I'll show you guys some clips from it. And then I have my chemical engineering lab. So basically this is how it looks. At first he was doing PowerPoints, but now he's like screen sharing with his iPad where he like writes on the screen and then all of us can follow along and take notes so zoom has lots of options i haven't really explored too much it's like a chat feature and you can like message things but he never really sees it um and then you can like record it and other things so it's kind of cool this is my life now so more to advance you know, this will give you very exciting give it area give it area always elements so that's you do a lab class right about now um uh, so basically the way that they're doing it, I should be watching these videos now, um, is they are doing like lab videos. So I think I'm on pumps this week and we are just literally watching a bunch of videos like this one. Howdy, this is the video demo for the centrifugal pump experiment for CHE444. In this first video, we're going to... So 
that bit's fun. Um, and then they're giving us, like, data, depending on the group that you're in. Yep, there it is. So then we are basically just doing our lab reports off the data that they're giving us, and they give each group a different set of data. So it's kind of like, it's very different how they're doing it. Some of my teachers, like my teachers in my business classes, um, they really know what they're doing, and I've been doing like breakout rooms, and they've been like sending us to talk with other people in our groups. Very different, I think, your experience depending on what teacher you have and also what type of class you have. I haven't yet had to take an exam. They've like scheduled them, but I have no idea how it's gonna work. I'm very curious, but yeah, there you go. That's a day in the life of a relocated online college student. Big, big, I'm confident now. Here, I'll tell you my really juicy story. Oh, on camera? Okay. Well, you- Oh, you froze. I oh my God, we, we shouldn't put this on the internet. You really shouldn't. <laughs> we won't put it on the internet. Just say hi. This is how I spend my day using Zoom. Oh, it says my internet connection's unstable. Oh, I hope I don't get kicked out. Guys, yesterday my mom kicked me out of my class because she decided in that moment to reset the Wi-Fi. That's awkward. Yeah, it was awkward. So, I think that's pretty much it. Sometimes I usually end off my day doing, like, a little bit of yoga or a workout or something. My friends and I like to house party or Zoom or... FaceTime and do a workout together, just something that we saw on YouTube. Um, my mom and I are going to do one of those like 28 day challenge things since we're both all stuck in the house. I don't really do much. I wake up late. I either go to online class or watch the recordings of it later, do homework, and watch TV. That's pretty much it. And I'm trying to do my best socializing. It's been a good minute since I've been home. You guys have any suggestions of some things I can do to spend my day? I do have a video coming out soon of like some ideas, but I would... <laughs> it's been one of those weeks. So I hope you guys all enjoyed and I will see all of you next time for my next video.